guys, today I'm going to show you how I get this flawless fluffy twist out. And this particular method is especially good for people with really tightly coiled roots, such as myself. So, <laughs> I hope you guys enjoy this video. And please, don't forget to subscribe, give this video a big thumbs up, share this with all your friends, and comment below what you'd like us to do next. Love you guys! Okay guys, so I'm starting with freshly washed and freshly detangled hair. If you guys want to see exactly how I wash and detangle my hair and all of that, I'll leave the link to the video right here in this little corner right there. Can you see that? Cool, great! So as you can see, I'm putting my, what is it, Curls Unleashed product on my hair. This is going to be my styler. And after that, I'm going to seal it in with my Light Wild Growth Hair Oil. So now I'm just gently brushing through my hair. Make sure you take your time with this step, and this step is also totally optional. Now some parts I didn't brush through because I'm not trying to rip out my hair, but other times I want to brush through so it's nice and neat and without imperfection. So when it comes to my twist outs, I found that first putting a braid at the top of the twist makes my hair smoother, elongates my curls more and whatnot. I find that this also keeps my hair from getting tangled easily. So feel free to do this method. This is how I do all my twist outs. Here I am just twisting my hair all the way down as you guys can see and when I get to the end what I do is I twirl that little part around my finger so it makes a nice little coil and my ends will come out really nice and neat. So here's the finished product of the first twist braid thingy. So now I'm just going to show you guys the process in fast motion. I'm going to show it to you about two more times just so you can see exactly what I'm doing and nothing changes really. I still start off with my styler then my sealing oil, which is the wild growth, and then I do the braid and the twist all the way down. guys so as you can see I've already done one side of my hair showing you the length right quick and now I'm taking my wild growth again and I'm going to put this on the twists before I take them down this keeps them from getting frizzy adds a nice shine and seals my hair as well as nourishes it so altogether it's a really great thing to do my dear, I am ready to so as you guys can see, I'm gently working my way up the twist and I'm separating as I go just very carefully so it doesn't get too frizzy. Now I want my hair to be really big so I'm separating a lot. You guys can separate as much or as little as you want to.
so now that I'm finished on doing all the twists, I'm just fluffing my hair from the roots. That's what I do first, get my roots nice and fluffy. And then after that, I'm going to use my afro pick to really get the hair nice and big. Afro pick, in my opinion, is totally necessary. This part isn't as necessary, but I like for my edges to be laid. And after I lay my edges, I take some more wild growth, rub it on my hands, and I put it on the surface of my hair so that my hair is nice and shiny and nourished and just happy. Ta-da! This is what I've ended up with you guys. I hope that you like it. I'm definitely loving this twist out. My hair is super fluffy, super bouncy, and very, very well defined. So I'm definitely going to do this method all the time. Thank you guys so much for watching please don't forget to subscribe share this video give it a big thumbs up and comment what you'd like to see i definitely need to get back to doing some natural hair videos because i've been slacking and i'm sorry about that you guys but thank you for your support and god bless